Okay, YouTube family, look like we got some things that untook a turn. Boy, I've been telling y'all, these little boosty interviews with Vlad TV has been classics after classics after classics, and we ain't talking about gymnastics with the elastics. Talking about that thing comes back in multiple ways. Look like Young Blue finally got called out by Boosie himself. Before the call outs, it was subliminals this, subliminals that. Well, Boosie Boo finally let Vlad TV know how he really feeling. Shout out to Vlad TV, by the way. I I support that man all the way because he got classics after classics. I don't feel the way Young Blue feel, but I know what I got to do is present the news. We're going to have some, you know, copyright situations, educational purpose. I want to give love to Vlad TV. I'll be using some of his resources and receipts to provide for this video today that we're doing man young blue basically is calling out boosie boo and, and boosie boo is gonna call him out too so this is a two for two i need y'all to subscribe to osmo hip-hop live hit that like button hit that notification bell come rock out with the platform that's booming and moving right now i smoke hip-hop live you dig subscribe 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 let's drop that fbg duck intro fbg shit <laughs> So, Young Blue decided to write a few comments. Now, the first one was him responding to the Boosie interview. Before I get to the Boosie one, this is what he had to say about Vlad TV, which I disagree with, but let's hear it. He said, Vlad, you got your wish, bruh. You've been building this ish with me and Boosie for five interviews straight. After we constantly told you the love we have for each other, you got what I wanted, white man. Some black men going at it. I disagree because you have to be accountable for your own actions. But let's read his second response to Vlad TV. He said, Vlad, you finally got what you've been waiting, man. You ain't stop pressing till you got the response you wanted out of us you live for this don't you long as the ish benefits your platform but i'ma no longer speak on it i just got some great new to balance that interview i just had to watch i'm a basically i'm real as they come now i'm gonna get to his response to boosie but i want boosie to respond because vlad tv is not somebody to be played with vlad look like he keeps that energy as well salute to vlad vlad is gonna do these back-to-back -back boosie interviews and y'all this was something to see man this was like classic now boosie is going to respond to him signing and forging his name let's go young blue did an interview recently yeah. where he said that uh essentially after he got the drake feature empire upped his deal from i think three hundred thousand to like nine million you seen that out there uh i ain't read it i ain't read it let me just double check i don't think he should be putting that up yeah so basically he, he did an interview uh with academics and he said, uh, yeah, yeah, I remember uh, I did an interview with Young Blue maybe about a year ago, and uh, I don't know whether he was unhappy with the interview Yeah, they or fucked what. up, man. Oh, man. Uh, 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 co uh, they Remember fucked what? up, man. Oh, man. Uh, oh, and uh, I don't know whether he was unhappy with the interview Yeah, they fucked what. up, man. Oh, man. I don't want to explain it, bro, but, 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 but it's... it's when it comes to play, I, I can't hide it once it's coming out. I mean, look. When it comes to play, Vlad, like they, they made forges on my signatures. What? Like they even spelled my name wrong. <laughs> Jesus, I ain't gonna lie. I get rolling all the time when Vlad start laughing like that with little Boosie. You feel what I'm saying? It actually do get a little bit hilarious. No disrespect to this man himself uh, uh the one they call you feel me young blue but this situation went a little bit more hectic now young blue also gave his opinion and chimed in years ago but before this even took place you know what i mean he gave his opinion on how it feels like to be signed by boosie himself now let's go to that and hear that out imagine if i had just waited 
Yeah. You know? Um, so you dropped Investment 2. Mm-hmm. And then that's how Boosie kind of linked up with you? Uh, yeah, I, yeah, I dropped Investments 2. Uh, I mean, it's, 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 it's a bigger situation than that. I dropped Investments 2. I was, I, was, I was already getting booked for shows just off the mixtape with the buzz I was building on my own. And then, uh, being honest, that's how it happened. Like, he was, you know what I'm saying, Booster Brother was on the uh, email. And, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying, I guess he liked what I sent. Sent it over to Booster. Booster liked it, too. He called me. You know what I'm saying? Flew me out the next day. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And me. Next day? Yeah. Next, scrolling down this page. Scrolling, 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 scrolling. That when I had found his brother page. And I had went on his page, DM him. And he hit me back. Then I said, I was like, man, let me see some music with him. Now, this was Young Blue describing what it felt like to be signed by Little Boosie. Now, Boosie responded to these situations as well, and boy, did he respond. The flashback was when Vlad was asking Boosie about, you know, Drake feature elevating his young artist, Young Blue's career. Now, let's go to it so you can see that DJ uh, uh, Vlad TV has never been biased. He's been fair. And, and the questions he asked was even more fairer. So let's go to that as well. Bless so many motherfuckers for real, bro. And the, and the industry should be thankful for him. CEOs, everybody should be thankful for him. But that nigga reached out to young niggas and blessed them, bro. Like a lot of people, bro. Like a lot of old niggas ain't do that, bro. Got a verse. He said, New album, No Friends in the Industry. Yeah, man, listen, on the, I finally found the song I was talking about. It, on his new album, No Friends in the Industry, Drake got a verse. He said, you get Drizzy on a track, he'll put you on a map. Yep. I mean, did, as someone, you know, that works with Young Blue, when Drake did the song with Young Blue, was it just a totally different situation afterwards? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, how could you not like the laugh that Boosie does with Vlad TV? It's always hilarious, man. But we heard snippets from the Vlad TV show. If you want to go see the whole um, video of that, I challenge y'all to go subscribe to Vlad TV and watch those few full interviews of the young Blue and little Boosie situation. Now, Boosie, I remembered when young Blue gave him $100,000. Boosie already explained that was kind of BS about the $100,000. Now, um, before I show young Blue's response, let's go to that 100,000 famous video at the time of it. Okay. Platinum. Big CEO, bitch. Yeah, young blue just gave me a hundred K cash. Nigga just gave me a hundred K. Give me the rest of it. That nigga just gave me a hundred K cash, man. Yeah, I mean that. I mean that. She don't wanna go to see she angry. Yeah, and I mean that. We can change places. Nigga ain't never gave me over a thousand dollars for I swear to God. Nigga, I'm grateful, nigga. Yeah. Now, you can see a lot of the energy back then was kind of different, you know what I mean? Folks had love for each other as far as what it came to as that. Now, Young Blue and some more receipts, so you can see those years ago what he said to Boosie, and you, you could tell it was like a love relationship, but I was always looking at the numbers. I was like, things ain't adding up. Things ain't making sense. Why I'm not looking at contractual you know obligations at this i'm seeing a lot of love and and, and that's cool too we love the love part but he said i can tell basically the new artist he's referring to 
He says, I can tell the new fans I've been signed to Boosie since 2017. He been hollering blue a star before anybody. I used to go in this nigga's closet and pick out my outfit for videos. He gave me money to hit the mall, gave me a rolly chain, posted my mixtape and just kept it real. So where did it go wrong? Because in 2022, here is the new response by Young Blue. He said, I put millions in myself, investments. Why would I let a nigga take millions from me? I tried to make millions with you and you ignored my vision. Treated me like a little dog. Came through every time you needed me. I re upped your brand all over the world, all on national TV. Every interview, every show. I can't believe you keep shitting on me. In these interviews, like you ever spent a dollar on me, like you gave me anything when I signed, not one dollar, bro. Never paid for one video, one marketing plan. I never told the world that I always gave you praise, but you shit on me in interviews. Now, I'm going to be fair, man. I don't know who's telling the truth or who's lying, but we know Little Boosie has always been a stand-up individual. He has never seemed to be no educational purpose, lame type of dude out here. Young Blue has displayed situations with baby mamas and all that, but we all have, so I don't want to take points from him. But we just went through receipts of receipts of receipts of proof that somebody is lying. Somebody ain't telling the truth. Somebody is copying either please behind the scenes or what, but it ain't Boosie. We done seen receipts, even using the Vlad interviews to show that little Boosie's been solid according to the words of Young Blue. Now, maybe they can get things squared away and fixed. I don't like seeing that. It's kind of like a bad situation turning into a sad situation. I hope Young Blue figures everything out. Everything gets squared away in the best situations that it could. Man, look, I'm your guy, DJ Bless One. Thank you for loving your family and your kids and stay blessed, man. Have a great day. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe to the platform. Like, share, and subscribe. Don't miss no new videos we dropping they're coming back to back back in the words of drake back to back you hear me blessings to the kings and the queens in the room let's drop that fbg duck intro fbg shit